Hello guys. Building my workspace is uh, quickly coming to a finish. And uh, next I have to wall mount this uh, unwall mountable monitor. Uh, it's not occupying a whole lot of space on my uh, workbench. Basically it's just a uh, an uh, office uh, desk but uh, yeah I would still want this to be attached uh, directly on the wall so yeah let's get right into it and see what we can do as you can see probably there was a similar model that had uh, the option to be wall mountable but uh, this one doesn't have the holes uh, only through the plastic so yeah I'm going to see what I can do about that of course I'm going to uh, remove this uh, support from these three screws and then uh, you maybe can see one screw here one in that corner and two in the upper corners Basically I'm going to remove those and take up uh, out the back of the monitor and see if the plastic is strong enough to, to hold the monitor without uh, making new holes in the metal. Basically I'm going to try and uh, uh, hold it on the wall only with the plastic. But do not do this with uh, monitors that are heavier than this or TVs. Basically this is a 15 inch monitor, it's really really light, so most likely the plastic will not fail and it will be able to hold it without issues. But if it is bigger, you must uh, find a way to drill holes even to the, through the metal. But again, be very careful uh, because you might run into electrical problems and you might uh, kill yourself, uh, yourself basically because there might be high voltages in there so yeah be very careful what you are doing but for this one it will be pretty easy as I will not go through the metal this is the back of the monitor it is off and this is the support that I'm going to use basically it's a really really cheap and small one ideal for what I need so let me just open it up. Hopefully, yeah, I have to cut it with something. Come on. Some screws. And this is the little support. Let me just check. Not really sure which of them is the one uh, that will go onto the monitor and which on the on the wall. I'm actually thinking that this will go onto the monitor because it seems to have more holes for uh, different uh, spaces between the screws, and this will go onto the wall. So basically, that one stays like that, and the monitor comes in like this. Actually no, sorry, other way around, like this, and it is latched in place, so you can remove it just by lifting it. And I would like to have the monitor a little bit like this, so I'm going to put some spacers between the support and the wall, and that should be about it. Let's attach this to the the back and basically see if some of the holes line up and they do now I should uh, should have uh, some screws with uh, a very small uh, head so they will not push uh, too much on the metal behind so flat uh, but uh, thin. Let's do some searching. I found some uh, screws. 
they are not uh, ideal for what I need but they have a big uh, head and pretty flat and they do not pass through the holes and they pass through these ones without any issues but uh, yeah basically these are not uh, uh, screws for uh, uh, to use with a knot basically these are for wood or any other thing so I'm going to this work together maybe you can see I'm going to cut this part from here uh, use this remaining part to put into the wall and uh, screw this in and the rest of it this part I'm going to use at the, uh, I will cut this in half and I'm going to use this uh, plastic part uh, as a knot on this and that should work uh, pretty good I could go and buy some but uh, I like to, to use what I have lying around the house it is done you can see this is really 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 strong and that is what it looks like what it looks like on the other side basically I'm not going to put uh, the monitor back together until I see it uh, staying correctly like this uh, on the wall after that I will assemble the monitor next I put some double, uh, double sided tape on the part of the support that uh, goes uh, basically like this on the wall and I'm going to put it uh, uh, inside the, this support from the monitor and together I'm going to place them exactly in the position where I want uh, the monitor to be so then I can check if I can actually slide the monitor uh, up and away because of this uh, sup uh, thing I can find the name for it where I put uh, my stuff so yeah I don't want to to end up not being able to take away the monitor if needed because I, I really have to to take it uh, to move it a lot so it, it will slide out of this so yeah let us check that in a moment this is staying on the wall with uh, double sided tape at the moment and of course the first position when I uh, I put it on the wall was too high and I could not uh, slide the monitor uh, off of it so this is the perfect position I'm, I already marked the holes and now I can take it off, drill the holes and attach it uh, perman permanently so yeah this is uh, a good idea to make sure you do not uh, put it in a wrong position uh, and you have to drill new holes so let's do this. Holes drilled, two screws are uh, already in. I'm going to use this type of uh, spacer. It's made by uh, from very tough plastic. I got this with uh, a support uh, not exactly like this, a little bit uh, bigger. It had some spacer, so I've cut it uh, to size and uh, yeah, I'm going to put another one here one is already here so this side will be like this a little bit so yeah I'm going to do that now my measurements are uh, perfect and that little guy in the corner has just enough room so I couldn't be happier with this at this point I'm going to put back the monitor together and this guys is the final product as you can see nothing will sit uh, on my workbench uh, all the time anymore so I quite like this uh, setup next uh, I have to to mount my uh, keyboard somewhere in this area right about there on a, a slide and uh, yeah 
I'm ready to work on computers with everything uh, set up uh, just the way I want it. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you found this video enjoyable. Give it a like, subscribe and see you next time. Bye.